Now here's another uh, type of over-unity device. Uh, this is called the Griggs Hydrosonic Pump. And he's got a patent on it. So this is uh, by James L. Griggs. They have a company called Hydrodynamics you might want to look up. And just some patent information I was studying on it a long time ago. I don't use any of this, but it's just handy stuff you might want to think about. Now, the hydrosonic pump is just the typical, some of you have seen, most of you have seen this already and know about it, but it's the drilled shaft, uh, which spins inside a housing, water goes into it, and you have here a cavitation that's created, which creates, I believe it's about 70% more output from those cavitation bubbles, which and that, that relates to things like sauna luminescence and cold fusion. But you have uh, power coming in and about 70% more power output from your energy draw through the vacuum at that point. Um, you may want to look into running butane or some of your, your closed circuit working fluids through one of these things and you would probably increase the power. However, you have very high temperature bubbles there which could lead to an explosion in the system if you were running uh, butane working fluid through here. And my point is, is that if you were to run at a very low RPM, just enough to get a little bit of cavitation, and you were running something non-flammable, a uh, different type of refrigerant, say uh, not propane, not, a, not really um, uh, ammonia or butane, but you know R12 or something, you might be able to have some fun with that uh, system. You know, that, pro that pilot light type system might might only need a little bit of heat rather than a lot. And, uh, or you might be able to shut it down and kind of get it started with a little bit of heat and then throttle it back to the point where it's just a real faint, faint flame. And, uh, you know, that could be a real, real, real efficient burning generator there that does burn fuel. Uh, but we have systems that will do the same without burning fuel, so there's really no point to it.